It'll be the new spot. Okay, guys, today we're going to look at the drill doctor, how to sharpen a drill bit with the drill doctor. Uh, again, if you, if you like the drill doctor, you can look in the description and you'll see the link on where you can get it. What we got here is a 3 8 drill bit that if we can get it in close enough here, you can see the edges are chipped. And so what, what we got to do is we got to get it sharp again so it cuts. So here we go. The, the, the biggest key to using a drill doctor is these notches right here, when you go to your alignment setting, see right here, we'll zoom in real quick. It says 118, it's 118 degrees. It has to do with your drill pitch. Now this is just for traditional drill bits. If you're doing something fancy, you may need to look a little further, but if you're just working with traditional drill bits, this is fine. Make sure you set it on that with the notch right there. Okay, next thing, you're gonna hit this. That's gonna open the alignment tool. So you slide your drill bit in. And what it's gonna do is it's gonna clamp right here and that's gonna set your angle for your drill bit while you're sharpening. So we've got that set. You lock it down, it's got a clamping mechanism inside the jig. Okay, we can release it, our drill bit is set, we're ready to sharpen. Switch is just right there on the back side, somewhere. Oh, it's over here. Let's turn it on right here. Doesn't really matter how you set it in, just as long as you're square. Just work it back and forth. And that was only half, now we're gonna do the other half. You can see right here, we still see a little bit of a chip. Not much. On the other side, we're looking pretty solid. So we'll just do it a couple more times. Looks pretty good. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna do is we turn it to the side. Now this setting on the side right over here, what this does is it sharpens the tip or you know just brings the edge in so that you don't have such a big flat point right here. Now, you see the white mark on your jig. There's a white mark right here too. You line that up. And then you'll flip it over, get another white mark, do the exact same thing. What you see is this edge right here, see how it beveled it up? That's what sharpens the tip and you have a point. Now we got a drill bit. So one more thing, I told you we set it at 118 dead center. It's also important that you make sure your jig is set at 118 because that's what we're cutting our bit to. If, if you have different bits where you got to change the pitch and everything, uh, traditional bits are all 118, but there are oddballs out there. And these are adjustable and this will slide to set your different pitches and then you're going to set it different over here. But for most people, the 118 is going to be fine. Just make sure this guy's locked down. You lock it down right here on 118. All right, thanks, guys. Check the uh, description if you're interested in the drill doctor. 
Okay, so my buddy challenged me. He handed me this bit. He said it's really rough. So you can see somebody took a grinder to it. The edges are they're pretty rough. So we're going to see how the drill doctor does on a drill bit that's really screwed up. Same thing, guys. We're going to open this dude up. Okay. We got both jaws locked in. We'll tighten it up. Let's see how it does. Edges look pretty sharp, looks pretty good to me. Oh, if you look right there, still a slight chip on the edge, so we'll go a little further. Same thing, line up your white line. Do the same on the other side. Looks like we got a nice sharp point. Think she's ready. Got another drill bit ready to go. That quick. 